Hi y'all, today we're going to go through the, the downpipe and the cold side, so stick around. and it goes down to the bottom of the truck and we also have it tapped for our wideband O2 sensor And come to the bottom of the truck with me and I'll show you how we hooked it up to the exhaust. This is where the downpipe hooks underneath the truck to comes down again. This is where the, the downpipe hooks to the bottom of the truck. And as we go down, we make two 90 degree bends and then we go down to the exhaust. Now on to the cold side. We're going to start with the inlet. This is a 4 inch elbow and it comes down and our K&N filter hooks right underneath it. Now we're going to go to the inlet side. We took our stock inlet and we cut it off right at the elbow. Then we put an adapter on it which came to the mass air meter. And there's another adapter here, a 3 inch elbow, which goes into your blow off valve. And from there we have a 3 inch to 3 and a half inch reducer, it goes down to the turbo. Okay, let's talk about some of the odds and ends we didn't show you on camera. First, we're going to start with the wastegate. And as you can see, we still need to add the exhaust to it. However, we took this lid off, took one of the springs out of it, and now it has a 5 PSI spring in it. And from the back of the wastegate here, we added a boost line that hooks to the front of the turbocharger. So now on to the oil system. We had to put a dash 4 elbow on here so that the hood of the truck would close securely. So you remember when we did our up pipe video, this sensor down in here was hitting the pipes. So we had to put an elbow on it too to get clearance. As you can see, we couldn't get the stock radiator hose to fit, so we went and bought this flexible stainless steel radiator hose. <laughs> I 
I know we just went through a lot of parts and I know we just went through a long list of parts in a short period of time but we'll try to put all the links to them below. If you found this video to be helpful or entertaining please make sure you hit the subscribe button. Until next time, bye!